morning. Welcome to live sunrise beach yoga. <laughs> oh, just laugh a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> how to relieve the stress in the body for the last seven weeks we've been working on the nine the seven chakras in the body this is nine chakras in the body the feet and the hands have chakras energy wheels of power that radiate in light in the rainbow colors at home, stand to the side of your mat. At the beach, we're gonna stand in front of our blankets. It's gorgeous this morning. We have an excellent rise. We're feeling great, we're feeling vibrant. We're feeling alive. Stand with the feet directly underneath the hip bones. Inhale, when we inhale, raise the arms up to the sky, nice and tall. Clasp the hands, lace the hands and stretch the palms towards the sky. Breathe in, look down at the ground, come up on the toes. Inhale, hold the inhale. Exhale, hands to heart, slowly come down on the heels. Ooh, feeling that good stretch. Good morning, love. Good morning, JC. Warming up the hands, aura opening. While we're warming up the hands lightly, we sing a mantra sound. A mantra sound is a universal sound of bringing good, peace, love, happiness into this body. That sound is ah, oh, mm. We sing it with the tip of the tongue to the roof of the mouth, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Breathe in deep. Um, two more times. We ask the archangels to come into this session today to give us guiding light and help. Inhale. Um, Big, strong inhale, reach through the crown of the head, nice and tall. Um. Open up the palms in front of the face. Stare into the center of the palms. See the healing white light of energy within the palms. Bring the left hand horizontal across the body, right hand underneath the left, so the forearms are in front of us. The left is gonna circle the right, the right is gonna circle the left. We're slowly gonna bend down and exhale forward. Belly button to spine to support the lower back. Slowly come down, bend the knees a little bit. And when the hands reach the feet, slowly spread the fingers wide reach with the palms all the way around the body that aura and connect the palms in front of the four shins facing out slowly bend the knees engage abdominals and come up lifting this precious healing white light of energy to us and bringing it to the heart Woo! hello glorious feeling of ariel in the wind Two more times. This aura openings clears the worries, clears the concerns, gets rid of the inhibitors in our life, the negative vibrations. Open up. Left on top of right. Slowly come down. Engage the abdominals. We always want to support that lower back in the body. Reach, gather Mother Earth's energy, grounding, circulating. Connect, open the palms away from us. Bend, lift up the energy, that vital power. We may not see it, but it is there. Bring it to us. One more time. 
We have about a 5 to 10 mile an hour wind depending on Ariel's bursts. It feels glorious because it has been hot and this feels fantastic. Open up, left on top of right, circle down the body. That vibration of energy that we just created between the palms is coming into our body. Reach the feet, spread the palms, the fingers out, around us, behind us, connecting to in front of us, palms facing out, and then slowly lift up that precious energy. Hands to heart. Bow. We're bowing unto ourselves. We're honoring our bodies. In this yoga session, if there is any pose that does not agree with this body, come out of it. We honor the body where it's at. Not like the yoga teacher who's been you doing this for over a year. Morning. Utita Tadasana, five-pointed star. Open the legs up, three and a half free, nice and wide. Toes are pointing forward. Open up the arms. The arms are parallel with the shoulders. We're breathing in. We're holding our arms out. We're breathing out. We're coming to goddess, bending the knees, opening up the groin, sit bones down towards the earth. Squaring our elbows with our shoulders. Let's flow. Breathe in, come up. Breathe out. Utkata Konasana, goddess. In, up. Out. Look down at the knees. The knees are out towards the pinky toes as much as possible. So we really feel that groin stretch. We have our sit bones towards the earth. So instead of out, we're down, grounding, up. Open it up wide, down. Four more, up. Nice one, glorious inhale. Nice one, glorious exhale. Feel the power of the breath in the body. By the power of the breath in the body, we are breathing this prana energy out. Two more. Oh. <laughs> Arms are getting tired, but they're also strengthening. In, hold it. Two, three, out. Hold it, two, three. Bring the arms in, straighten out the legs. Keep the legs open and bring them in just a foot. We look down to the ground for balance, for focal point to focus this body. Make sure in the beach that we have our feet grounded into the sand. Really nice stable stance. At home, lift up the toes, spread the toes wide and grab the ground, grab your mat. Breathe in, lift up. Come up on the tippy toes for balance. Clasp the hands above us. Last three fingers clasp, the thumbs engage. Exhale, come down, squat. In Malasama, we want to make sure that the knees are behind the toes. And we want to make sure that the sit bones are grounded into the earth. Breathe in, come up. Tippy toes. Nice tall. And down. Yeah. Hello. In, up. Yeah. Feeling good, feeling alive. Hello, up. And down. Up. And down. Each time we breathe up, we breathe in. Each time we come down, we breathe out in yoga.
three more, feeling the flow in the body, lift our spirits, lift our bodies. Engaging our foot chakras and our first chakra, Maladhara, our safety, our family, our well-being of health and wealth. One more, up. Reach, 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 tall, 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 tall. And then come back together, feet underneath the sit bones, hands to heart. Whew, that felt good, yeah. At, ma at home, come to the mat. At the beach, we're gonna come to the bottom of our blankets. Feet directly underneath our hip bones. We're coming down to the blanket eventually. First in uk Ukata Tadasana, which is chair, and then Uttanasana. Breathe in, lift the arms to the sky. Breathe out, bend forward. Hands to shin, our hands framing the feet. Let the head dangle. When we come up, we bend the knees, we engage the abdominals, come back up into chair. Revolving chair, come down. Inhale up. The sit bones come down towards the earth, and then we exhale. Correct, correcting and keeping the alignment in up in the body. Out, down. In, up, reach for the sky, the Han chakras, engaging the healing white light, down. Four more, up, reach, sit bones down, engage abdominals, down. Stretch it out, let the head dangle when we're in forward bend. Three more, up, down. Inhale, come up. down. Feel the flow of the body in. Breath. In, up. Hold the pose. Three, two, one. Bend forward. Let it go. Let the head dangle. Grab the elbows. Swing from side to side. One leg straight, the other leg bent opposite direction. Feel that wonderful, glorious opening in the lower back all the way up to the top cervical. Whoo, baby, yes. And by clasping the elbows, we have this fantastic opening. Let the breath come out and just feel open and released and love, passion. Breathe in, frame the feet. Breathe out, right foot back, right knee down, left foot back, left knee down. Oh, yes. Knees are directly underneath the sit bones. Wrists are directly underneath the shoulders. Spread the fingers wide. We want those palms into the earth to feel that fantastic energy of Mother Earth. Breathe in, lift up. Sit bones to the sky, chest to the sky. Breathe out, chin into the chest, round the back, belly button to spine. Slow inhales and exhales, flow with the body. In, stretch the throat up. Exhale down. Feel that kundalini energy opening up each vertebra opening up that tightness in the back. Whoo, hello, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, who, universe, thank you, angels, thank you, Athena, thank you, Carmen, thank you. 
JC, thank you Darlene, for in this body we thank our bodies for moving with the flow, for taking time out for us. We thank ourselves, we pat ourselves on the back, because who else is going to pat ourselves on the back? Congratulations me, thank me. That self-love grows first within us and then spreads to the world. Four more, up. Out. Always keep in mind that we loosen up the jaw. We bring the tip of the tongue to the roof of the mouth to rest it there, but the mouth is closed. When we do this, we release pressure in the skull. We release pressure in the tension of our worries and our concerns. And we just let it go. Reach up, inhale. Sip onto the sky, chest of the sky, hold the pose on the count of three, two, one, release, exhale, bow the back, yeah, oh yes, stretch it up like a cat, Woo! hello, come back to center, nice, take the big toes, touch them to each other, open up the knees nice and wide. Now, if it is too much of a groin stretch, we can always bring the knees back together. Cross the arms in front of each other. Place the forehead on top of the arms. In child's pose, we feel this release and all the pressure in our body and it and lifts our spirits. It lets us know, whew, I'm taking a break. I'm taking care of myself. Thank you, me. Yeah. Just sigh it out. Odd out. Fart it out. Whatever you want. Just get it out. <laughs> the point is to feel good. That's what life is all about, right? That's why we were given this life. Two more nice, long, slow, deep breaths. On the next breath, slowly come up to all fours. Roll over onto the left side, swing the feet forward. Come into a comfortable seated position. Kambala body breath, you, we might need a tissue. At home, go ahead and get a dry washcloth and a pillow. We're gonna need that too. Kambala body breath is rapid concessions out in and out through the nose. We breathe in deep first, sitting up tall. Exhale out all the air. Quarter of the way we breathe in with the mouth closed, rapid concessions out through the nose. Inhale deeply, out, Whew. now the head gets a little wobbly, the head gets a little dizzy, Whew. come back to normal when we breathe in deep and out and we feel that release, yeah, <laughs> straighten out the legs.
We can keep the knees bent if we need to. We can come down if we need to. Upside down plank is a very uh, arm strengthening pose. So if we need to come down, come down. Bring the palms behind us, spread the fingers out. Dig the palms into the earth, the floor at home. When we come up an upside down plank, we push our hips towards the sky. Again, honor your body where it's at. Breathe in up. Hold the pose for seven more breaths. Open the throat up, bring the head back. Strong thighs, strong arms. Again, honor the body. Breathe through the shakiness in the body, building strength in the shoulders, the arms, the legs, the abdominals. Three more breaths. Breathe in, press the hips towards the sky. Breathe out slowly, 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 come down. There we go. <laughs> Purvottanasana <laughs> can be intense, but it builds wonderful abdominal strength. Pashimottanasana. Hands on shins or hands or fingers coming around the toes. Breathe in, lift up the chest. Breathe out, bend forward, let the head dangle. Walk the sit bones back just a little bit to get that fleshy part flat with the earth and let it go, forward bend. This should be a medium to light stretch. If it is too intense, come up a little bit, but stay in the pose. In the forward bend, feel the opening. Allow the body to release with just breath. Bring the chin into the chest to hold it there. come up. Ooh, yes, 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 yes. Oh, that felt marvelous. Forward bends are so fabulous. Bring the left foot into the body. Open up the right leg nice and straight. Left hand by our left knee. Spread it on the earth, on the floor, nice and wide. When we spread our palms wide, the palm chakra reaches into the ground and Mother Earth's energy seeps up and goes, oh, I energize you like an energizer battery. Roll over onto the knee, lift the body up, stretch the left right arm across the body. Reach, reach, reach. Now take the gaze and look down at the ground, down at the left hand. If it is too much on the wrist, press between the first finger and the thumb, alleviating pressure. We have five more breaths. Slowly exhale, come down on the sit bones. Bring the left right arm down. Whoo, hello. 
Thank you, body. Thank you. Woohoo! Straighten out the left leg. Bring in the right. Oh, yes. This is my, my challenging side. Right hand, spread the fingers wide by the right knee. Roll over to the front. Lift the body up, stretch it across. Reach, reach, reach. Look, the gaze is down on the ground. Tuning in the third eye chakra with the Mother Earth. Close the eyes for internal focus. Feel the power inside of us. Touching that breath, that prana energy as we breathe in and out. Each time we breathe in, we reach, 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 opening up the obliques. Three more breaths. Long, slow, and deep. Reach with last breath, reach, 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 and slowly exhale, come forward, sit down. Oh, hello, thank you. <gasps> oh, that feels glorious. Bring the legs together straight out in front of us. Walk the sit bones towards the front of the blanket, front of the mat at home. At On the beach, we have a rolled up pillow this is best or we can bring yoga blocks behind us if you have yoga blocks at home we want the edge of the pillow to reach the top part of our shoulder but underneath our neck and we're going to slowly lower the body down on to it straighten out the legs I'm going to come out a little bit further so you can see we straighten out the legs Now take the forearms, place them underneath the buttocks. So the forearms are flush with the earth. Bring the legs together. When the legs are together, lift the toes towards the heels. And now slowly relax the heels back out down to, onto the surface. Take the top of the head. The top of the head is going to open up into the earth. Exposing the throat in this Matsyasana fish pose, we are tuning into all of our chakras. Cross the toes together if the feet are splayed out. We want the toes together for a correct alignment in the body. Lift the chest on the inhale and exhale. Make sure the body is comfortable. If the body is not comfortable, then come out of the pose, roll off the pillow or block. Breathe. Inhales and exhales. off and over onto the right side of the body excuse me left side of the body come into a fetal position straighten out the top leg 
The top arm lifts the body up to a comfortable seated position. At this point, we can take the pillow and place it right underneath the sit bones. When we do that, that lifts up the spine and we feel much better with our, each of our vertebra of our spine. Opening up the neck chakra, the throat chakra. Breathe in. Reach. Clasp the hands. Lace the fingers. Stretch it up towards the sky. Hello. Thank you. Exhale. Forward bend. Come all the way down. Let the head dangle. Allow the outward breath to bend us forward. Use the palms to hold us up. Gradually come down. We don't want to force it. Breathe in, slowly come up. Walk the hands to the body. Woo, hello, thank you. Yeah, that felt great. Ooh, look at that nice color in the sunrise, yeah. Opening up the throat chakra, the neck chakra. Sometimes we get so tight and tense, our shoulders feel like this. Loosen them up, feel glorious. Bringing the chin, lifting the chin to the sky as we inhale. And when we exhale, chin into the chest. And what are we doing? We're nodding yes. Yes to healing white power energy. Come into this body. Open me up. Say to ourselves, I release you. I let go of any worries, any tension. We are gloriously alive. We feel freedom. We feel happiness. We are calm in tense situations outside of us and inside of us. By taking our time with breath and body, we find that calmness, that peace inside of us. That peace transforms to health in the body, wealth in our pocket, calmness in our soul and spirit. Bring a smile to the face because <laughs> it feels so glorious to be alive. Yeah. Two more. Chin level with the earth. Breathe in, look out over the left shoulder. Breathe out, look out over the right shoulder. 
We can close our eyes for internal focus if we have balance in the body. We know we have balance in the body when our head doesn't feel wobbly when we breathe in and out. Yogic breathing takes a while to get used to. Because when we breathe in that yogic breath, we get lightheaded a lot. There's nothing to be scared of when we get lightheaded because we're, that lightheadedness is just telling us, hey, we're putting too much energy to, into this body too fast, so go nice and slow. Breathe in and out. Finding that energy. We're nodding no. No, I'm not going to have any more worries in my life. And if I do, I'm going to ohm it out. <laughs> and when I ohm it out, I feel so much better in the body. When I laugh it out, even though I'm concerned, even though there's a tragedy, I'm not laughing at the tragedy. I'm laughing to feel good in the body. So let's laugh a little bit. <laughs> even if it's a little baby giggle. <laughs> <laughs> Even if we don't want to laugh when we're going. <laughs> One more time over, inhaling the left shoulder. And then the right. And coming back to center. Circles, lifting the chin counterclockwise. Up, down, and around. Oh yeah, just taking the time, feeling those snap, crackle pops in the head, loosening up. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We're sitting tall, we're reaching up. Opening up Vishuddha Chakra. The Chakra of Listening. Blue in color. Seeing that radiant blue sky. Feeling the freedom we feel when we see the color blue. Knowing that if we tap into that inner self and we listen to our bodies that others will listen to us. That our conversations will be understood by others and ourselves. We talk to ourselves all the time in our minds. Now it's time to take a body check and talk to ourselves in a positive way. Hey, girl, look in the mirror. You look great today. Yeah. Look at those pretty eyes, those beautiful lips, that wonderful hair, and that gorgeous body. Yeah. Yeah. Bring the chin into the chest and opposite direction. Oh, yeah. On the outward breath, make sure we're bringing the shoulders down and loosening up the shoulders, telling the shoulders, hey, relax, man. No need to get tense here. Feeling good. Loving life, living it. <laughs> In this practice, we honor our bodies, we honor our emotions. We learn to tap into that inner wisdom, that inner power. Muladhara chakra opens up our safety, our health. Svarishthana Chakra opens up our passion, our creativity. Manipura Chakra gives us confidence. 
Anahata chakra gives us compassion. Vishuddha chakra helps us to listen to that inner voice a little bit more. Ajna chakra opens up that intuitive power in us. And Sahasrara chakra tunes us in to our higher self. Chin level with the floor. Roll over onto the left side, taking the pillow out behind us. Straightening out our legs, massaging the legs up and down. Now there is a gazing point called a Trataka. This Trataka is a point where we look at an object, we look at a candlelight in front of us, whatever's in front of us, and we concentrate on that. By concentrating on that, our memories increase, and we find that um, we can be snappy and think of good ideas and creativity. So in the beach, we're gonna look at an indentation, at home, look on your carpet or this corner of a mat and just gaze, breathing in and out with the hands on the lap. We can cup our hands however comfortably our hands are. Breathe in, sitting up tall, bringing a smile to the face. We can imagine when we're gazing at this point we see a loved one that we're just, or loved ones that we love so much. We're feeling that power of love within us. And we're automatically on the beach, so we feel that serene peace inside of us at home. Just imagine being here with us, feeling the wind across the face, caressing the skin flowing through the hair, listening to the ocean surf behind us, feeling the warmth of the sun. In the beach, we are connecting with all the elements, earth, wind, fire, water, ether. Ether is the silence in between breaths. Three more breaths. Each time the breath comes in, we sit up tall, opening up the spine, vertebra by vertebra, rolling the shoulders back and down. Keeping that smile on the face because the body's feeling good. Inhale, bring the hands down by the side. We're going to walk at the um, edge of our blankets at home, the edge of your mat. Take the pillow. When we lie down on the back, we can either have the pillow at our head or no pillow at all, depending on how you feel. On the beach, we have eye bags. At home, take your dry washcloths and place them over the eyes and slowly come down to the body. In a savasana pose, our legs are spread out. If this does not work for the lower back and we have a little crankiness in the lower back, bring the feet together and open up the knees. This gives a little hip stretch, but it also makes the lower back feel a lot better. Close the eyes. For 10 minutes, we are in this fantastic transition. Ooh, these eye bags are great. They definitely keep the internal focus into the body. It gives a little weight on the eyes so we focus on what's going on inside of us which is the breath.
take the mind's eye to the center of the feet, the bottom of the feet. Focus on the healing white light of warmth in the bottom of the feet. The foot chakra generates the power. It seeps up the shins, the calves, around the knees, the top of the knees, the back of the knees. This healing white light of warmth travels up the top of the thighs and the bottom of the thighs. The inner and the outer of the top of the legs. We feel the healing white light of the first chakra, Maladhara. We see the color red flowing bright as we can. We think of all the red things that we love about the color red. Maladhara chakra opens up the pelvis area if there's any tightness in the groin. Physiologically, we open up our inhibitors that deal with family worries, financial worries, health worries. We know what we need to do to take care of it, and we do it. The warmth, healing white energy travels up to the belly button area, which is Svadhisthana Chakra. It is orange in color. We think of all the things orange in our lives. It is our passion and our creative chakra. With this passion and creativity, we open up new possibilities in our lives. We feel the stress in our lower back lift and any internal organs are cleansed and pure. We breathe in and bring the energy to the solar plex chakra, Manipura, yellow in color, feeling the warmth of the sun and everything yellow in our life that's good and pure. Manipura chakra is our power, our center, our confidence in how we feel about ourselves, our confidence in how things go in circumstances in our lives. We breathe in and bring that energy to our heart chakra, Anahata. This chakra is green in color, thinking of all, all the green things that we love. We breathe in that energy wheel of compassion in our hearts, feeling the compassion for ourselves and how it transfers to others around us. We breathe in the energy to Vishuddha chakra, our throat chakra, blue in color. Our listening chakra, listening internally and externally, transferring that power to others. We breathe in and transfer the energy to our third eye chakra in between our brows, color of indigo. Our intuitive chakra that tells us, that warns us, that also tells us about good in our lives and that we need to take hold opportunities as we listen to that little conscience talking to us. 
We breathe in the transfer of energies to Sahasrara Chakra, our crown chakra. White in color. It is that energy that taps us into our higher self, the universe at large. We breathe in through the palm of our hand chakras. Red, white, and blue in color and sometimes gold. We feel that warmth in the center of our palms and all nine chakras in our body. These energy wheels are growing and glowing with a rainbow of colors. And that aura that everyone talks about circles us in vibrant colors. We breathe in deep and melt further and further into the earth. And in silence for three minutes. On the beach, we're slowly going to take the eye bags off and get something really bright in us. <laughs> oh, hello, it's morning. <laughs> Roll over onto the left side in a fetal position. The arms are stacked on top of each other. Straighten out the top leg and then push up with the top arm. 
into a comfortable seated position, sitting on our pillows. Oh, I know. Okay. Yeah. Bandhas are a secret energy lock in yoga. Mulabana is our urinary muscle engaged. Uddiyana Bana is our abdominal muscle engaged. And Jalandhara is our throat muscle engaged. Breathe in. Bow forward. Hold the breath in. Lift the chin to the sky. Lift the body up. Roll the shoulders back. Exhale out. Bring the chin into the chest. Bow forward. And come up again. Roll the shoulders back. Squeeze out all the air. Hold in Mulabana, Uddiyana, Jalandhara. And then let the breath go. Whoo, yeah. Nice and slow. Inhale. Hold the breath in. Lift the chest up. Lift the body up. Exhale forward. Chin into the chest. Torso comes up once again. Squeeze out all the air. Hold in the urinary muscle, abdominal muscle. Chin into the chest. Release. One more time. Inhale, bow forward. Hold the breath in, lift the chin up. Exhale, down through the throat, bow forward. Chin into the chest. Lift the chest up. Lift the body up, roll the shoulders back. Squeeze in our bandhas. Hold the breath out. Release. Oh, that felt good. Left hand over heart, right hand over left. Repeat after me. May I feel complete in this body as never before that I do now and so it is I am the light the light I am by holding our hands to our heart we end with the sound of Om times three to seal in this magnificent positive session we just had here on the beach breathe in tip of the tongue to the roof of the mouth um, two more times. Last one, make it a good one. Um, that vibration of energy, feel it inside. Bring a smile to the face because <laughs> it feels great. <laughs> Thank you for joining us in here at Live Sunrise Beach Yoga. Join us on Facebook on Monday mornings, every other Monday morning, live with Kimmy this Monday at around 6.45 a.m. Like us, subscribe to us, and get all those wonderful video um, announcements. We appreciate your subscription very much, and we thank you very much for honoring us on this channel. Namaste.